Can't be mad. Touch out. Hey, my grandma for Gonzalez. Don't mess with. Don't mess with. Don't mess with. Hey, nanny boo. I know you enjoying heaven. She, she up there. I know she enjoying it. She chilling, chilling like a villain. Hey, where God at? Shout out, shout out, nanny boo. I wish I would have gotten that. I know, lady. You know, I know she, I know she watching that. Where God at? I got some date to talk about. As a man, growing up, I was taught, well, you better hold that, you better hold that tear in. You better suck it up. You better be, man, don't be expressing yourself. Men don't express themselves. So country. I'm, I, I have a little country in me. If you don't know, I'm half country, half city. <laughs> that is so true. As Gonzalo you saw in the say. intro. Essay, Gonzalo, Gonzalo's an essay, come on. I, 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 I done been taught wrong. <laughs> oh, Lord. I was me. taught wrong, y'all. There's some, there's, there's so about. much value in expressing yourself. Yeah. Sierra yeah. could attest, our relationship didn't get to the next level until I learned to open up to Sierra. And be he's vulnerable still to. And I'm, he's still learning. I'm still learning, but I, you know, I'm better than what I was. You, I, you, you are. If I feel I some type of way, you gonna know about it. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Even if you don't like it. Okay? Okay? <laughs> But when we talk to God, we got we have to be able to be vulnerable to God. Your relationship with God is so important. And if you're closed up and feel like, first of all, what are you closed up for? God sees everything. He knows. He just wants you to confess and go to him yeah. for everything. Mm -hmm. There is nothing wrong with going to God angry. There's nothing wrong with going to God mad. You just got saved. All right, cool. I rejoice. Got my praise dance on. Now, God, let's talk. I'm because mad. why was my mama like that? Why did this happen to me? Why did my daddy treat me like that? Right. Why my bank account looks like this? Shoo. Why am I addicted to pornography? Shoo. Why? What happened? Why? You don't have to worry about it. If anybody showed us it's okay to be angry at God, it's Job. If you don't know the story of Job, my brother had everything. He had, as some people would say, everything. And God took it away. Have you ever felt like that? God is playing a video game with your life? <laughs> like, God, up. what are you doing? Stop. You're losing. No God, God, you're losing. Uh, <laughs> uh, up, up, down, B, B. What are you doing with my life? This is oh, not God, a, <laughs> my life is not a chess game. Let's check out Job real quick. Job 1, 20 through 22. Job stood up and tore his robe in grief. Then he shaved his head and fell to the ground to worship. He said, I came naked from my mother's womb, and I will be naked when I leave. The Lord gave me what I had, and the Lord has taken away. Praise the name of the Lord. And all of this, Job did not sin by blaming God. You can do anything you want, but you can't blame God. Go to God. Hey, God, I'm in this situation. I know how I got there. Let's be real. I know what I did. Help me. And God will give you tangible solutions all of a sudden now you see a commercial for a th free therapy all of a sudden you get that call from a real friend that actually wants to talk about your situation and pray for you not the dm from the the girl that you met last week the real tangible blessings and problem solvings will come if you go to god naked so i think we also have a difficulty being naked with ourselves right. first acknowledging who we truly are and what we are what we're experiencing. Yes. And here is holy. Shout out to TC Nation, yes. Trash Mike's Church, Trash Mike Todd. Mm -hmm. Here is holy. And here is holy might be disgusting. Here is holy might be disgusting. It might be not where you want to be. Yeah. It might be scary. It might be um, it's scary. Uh, it might be unapologetically, I don't know, weird. I don't know. Yeah. It, it might be uh, disappointing. Uh, but it's still holy because yes. if you allow God in, God is still there with you. He's right. still guiding your steps every day. Yes. Um, but being naked uh, for yourself is one thing. But then being naked to the God who knows everything 
you're like, oh, what does that look like? Right. You don't even we you don't even know what it looks like. So right. then it's scary for you to go into it. It's yes. scary for you, it's scary for you to try to step into knowing and allowing God to really expose you yes. to you. Yes. And I and I think for me, that's what I've learned is like, oh, I knew myself. Mm -hmm. I'm a multitasker. I can do this, I can do that. You know, and then I'm learning why was I a multitasker? Why was I a hustler? Why was I greedy? Why was I needy? That's just not who I am, but there's a reason why those things exist. And God, allowing God, allowing me to be naked in front of God has allowed me to see certain things in myself that I'm like, oh, wow. Yeah. I just I just confessed to William that in the next transition of where we're going, I'm scared. Like, I'm scared. And I said that. And I was just like, <laughs> but actually God revealed it to me after having this wonderful weekend of just being in a midst of people who are just lovely and God showed me like hey you're scared and I was like no I'm not <laughs> yes you are and I was like oh God I'm scared and, it, and it's okay yeah. like it's okay he's like I'm here to help you with that but I'm like how are you gonna help me with that like I'm living this real life for y'all like I'm like how are you gonna help me with that because right now I don't, I don't like being scared I I'm always in control. I'm like, independent woman, y'all know how it is. We yes. got this on lock. We've been taught to be on lock all the time. And I'm just like, ooh, okay, you want me to be real? Okay, now I gotta tell my husband, my spouse, that I actually am scared. And then I have to walk it out. I'm, I'm living this, but I'm, I'm, hopefully this could touch somebody and help someone gracefully right. live um, a life more abundantly past what you see. And if you go forward and be naked to God, he reveals things to you. And I think that in itself is kind of scary because right. you're like, I got this on lock. I, I, I've been raised this way. Generations of me have been this way. And it's like, God's like, no, that's what they thought they had to do. But I'm doing something different anyway. You ain't gotta do, you ain't gotta be that way. You, you ain't gotta walk that way. You don't have to. And just that knowing is a little bit of fear. And God is not a God of fear. He wants these things for you. Right. So be naked with him. Stop fighting that relationship. Stop fighting that yearning to get to know who he is. And allow Jesus and the Holy Spirit to guide you day in and day out. Jesus is an example for us to, on this earth that he saved us. That's like, it is that simple. Very simple. But it's difficult because we are so driven by what we see and what we feel. And we got air in it. And we're so driven by that. But be driven by getting to know who God is for yourself yes. and allow him to lead you and guide you every day, day in, day out Amen. on what you should do. And he'll expose things to you to allow you to live a new abundant life with him. Amen. Amen. I love y'all so much. We thank you guys so much. If you like this and feel like someone else needs to hear it, please yes. share, 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 share. Let everyone that in your circle listen to this so that they can also not live in fear yeah. of going to God for everything. That's what he wants. He wants oh. you to want him. Yes. And want him back. Because he made you anyway, right? Straight up. Straight <laughs> Straight up. Anyway, Straight right? <laughs> we love y'all. Have a good day. Have a pleasant day. Love y'all guys. Bye. 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 Bye.